Good evening and welcome back to Cricket Captain 2023 and we're back in the county championship today. A different competition. We've played a lot of Blast and to be fair we have not done very well. We've played seven games of which we only won one. Um, but I'm actually going to quickly show the recent results and you can kind of see how close these games have been. We've been competing which is something I can't really say we were doing much of last season so although the results are still not the way i would like them to be we are competing and it is a bit better okay so now what are we going to do travis had still away on international so bavuma is going to play we're going to look at the current year averages and see what we want to go with so El drummond's been out of form unfortunately <clears throat> yeah been out of form big time so he needs a bit of time you would say to get some form under his belt means who do i want to open with him we're still missing sam cook let's not forget we'll take a quick look at that we've got seven days still broken finger before we get sam cook back so this will be a slightly more difficult um match coming up here I don't think I want to play Snater, but uh, you know what? Snater could probably earn himself a a game. Do Richards first, and then Wokesy's got to come back. Paul Walter's also got to come back. Um, yeah, probably for Bolland because Rossington is the <clears throat> Rossington is the go-to. Vuma's at three. Yeah, like that. I mean, that's not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Two spinners, three. Yeah, I like that. Um, <clears throat> Snater, you can play second team. I think I'm going to have to give Rymo a chance at opening here. Um, or Dan Lawrence. No, I don't want to open with Dan Lawrence. Play second team Bolland. I don't really want to open with Wesley. I need an opener. Oh, Drummond's so out of form. I'm going to give Rymo a go. Um, Tom Wesley's going to play instead of. Instead of Paul Walter. Okay. Yeah, okay, it gives us another spinner option instead of the pace of Paul Walter. I don't mind it. He'll be captain, Rossington keeper. Good stuff. Okay, let's go. We want to, what do we want to do? Probably want to, probably want to bat, to be fair. You want to make, we've been put in. So, sorry, wanted to bowl, but I probably wanted to bat under the assumption that they both prefer pace. Okay, that's not a bad start. Under the assumption that the pitch is just going to degrade over time. So I want to be bowling in that fourth innings. I don't mind a slower start, but I do mind that. So Rymel potentially is really not up to uh, up to scratch at the top, the top uh, level here. Bavuma hits a four to get things going, and we are we are going to struggle here if we want we're three for one off the first. So going to be more defensive this this whole session really, just because we do not want to give away silly wickets. That's a good shot. I don't mind hitting shots, but I do not want to give away any silly wickets. Yeah, there we go. That's the basically the same shot. Brown, good stuff, and. Let's just see if we can get fully settled. It might be a slow start. I'm I'm fully aware, but um, oh, that's a no ball, so that'll be a six. Great stuff. Forty-two for one. A good start. A good recovery. Let's say after um six runs with us, we Nick Brown. Wow. After not a great great introduction to the game for Josh Rymel, unfortunately. Great recovery since. I'm not going to change anything. I really just would like to get to the end of this session one wicket down um, and no more. 
taking it session by session if possible. Yeah, good stuff. That'll be a 50. No. Okay, it wasn't. It was just an edge. Fine. Lavuma and Nick Brown both in the 30s. So not far away from a 50. And now up into 39, into the 40s, Nick Brown. And we have, I would say we've done well. We've done well to recover from that kind of bad start. Let's try and get to lunch. And we have indeed 91 for one, a good recovery. How are, oh, there's a test match. Oh, <laughs> yeah. There's a test match and it does not look good. What, um, how many sessions have gone? So that's a whole day. Um, and then it would have been England who got bought. So that's like the end of day two. That's like middle of day three. So it could be like end of, this could be day three. It could be day four. Um, either way, not looking good for England. It's not looking good for England at all. Yeah. Look at that team, though. It's a different team. It's a quite an interesting team. Williamson still smacking runs. Same for Lathan and Daryl Mitchell. Wowza. Devin Conway as well. Sodi's still in the team. Jameson's still in the team. Yeah, it's not pretty good. And we're just going to keep things going as they were going. Uh, when both batsmen are fully settled and maybe even have made their 50s, we will. We will have a look at increasing the aggression. But from where we were, there we go. That's a 50 up for Nick Brown, I believe. Or was it Pavuma? No, it was Nick Brown. Nick Brown's gotten a 50. Really good stuff. And now Pavuma should be quite close to a 50. Oh, okay. Not quite on 48. This is Brown. Oh, that's edge but safe. Pavuma, is this the 50? Going to run the quick single. And that's it. 50 up for Temba Bavuma. Incredible stuff. And the partnership is looking good. 113, a really good recovery from where we were. So now let's up the aggression just a touch and see if we can increase the, the run rate. Because the run rate's not terrible so far, but I would like a little bit more. Um, after 45, we're at 120. Okay, so that's... <clears throat> That's, well, not very much at all, is it, really? That's 2.2 two point whatever, 2.6 or so. But not great. So, yep, that's safe. That's fine. Let's see if we can kick on from the over 45 onwards. Um, let's see. Not bad. Okay. They're both still settled. So... I don't actually think I need to increase the aggression. And yeah, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. I'm not going to do anything silly um, here. I'm just going to let the two batsmen at the crease do their thing. They're just going to keep going. I just need to adjust the camera a touch. There we go. That looks a bit better. And oh, no, I wasn't watching. bavuma has gone. It looks like he was caught behind. Kind of a, yeah, an odd one to get an edge on, but fair enough. Let's see if Tom Prest can just come. So the crease is already off the mark. That's great. And uh, I want to end the session for two if I can. Yeah, great stuff. 31 minutes left. And we want to keep, keep Nick Brown uh, doing some damage if he can. That's four runs. And Prest is looking settled already. Great work. There's T. Like I, I know we're batting slowly. But it's all about recovery. And uh, Nick Brown can go a little bit more aggressive when he's fully settled again, actually. When he's fully settled again, if if he can. 162 for two is a lot better. From from three for one. I'm uh, I'm very happy with where we are. And Nick Brown's fully settled now. Now the task is getting Tom Press to be settled as well. Oh, and there is Brown gone. The aggression. The aggression was the undoing. Rossington, yeah, good stuff. I'd like Rossington to get to the end of the D. Oh, misfield. Good shot. I want Rossington to get here 
and then I'll up his aggression to uh, regular levels. Sorry, I've taken the new ball. Fine. Shot. That's a cracking shot. And there we go. He can go up a little bit now. Um, just got to play the situation a little bit. You, know, you just got to play the situation. It doesn't really matter that we're batted a little bit slower here. And fully settled. I think I can now tell Rossington to go 20 minutes at a regular pace. Yeah, good stuff. Already into the 40s. Tom Prest is also into the 40s and looking for a 50. And that'll be that. That'll be 50 up for Tom Prest. Incredible stuff. Only Rymel not really been able to get get some runs, which we were giving we were giving him a chance just as a uh, as a replacement to Bell Drummond, but he clearly isn't quite doing it. Rossington on 45 overnight. Really good stuff. I'm really I'm really happy. Let's take a look. Yeah, New Zealand got the win. They bowled England out. Um, West Indies. To be fair, West Indies looking good. They should get that win. Uh, Yorkshire. All out for 300. A much different, a very different game to the way I'm, the one I'm playing. And Somerset are on their way. Sussex 380 for eight. Again, a much different game to the one I'm playing. And Orr has absolutely smacked some runs. We're out there. Wowza. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Mortaza with a duck, though, and Archer and Carson at the crease. That's very similar to their T20 team. Not much of a change at all. And Kent all out, Durham 90 for four. Lots of wickets. 14 wickets in one day in that game. Only three in my game. Yeah. A really, uh, a really different game. But we're, we're, we're playing a different game here. We're going to see if we can keep the pressure on, try and build a lead. And, uh, yeah, play. we're playing a different game. That's fine. You don't have to play. Oh, come on, Rossington. That's a bit silly. Second ball of the new day. Just given Sussex a freebie, really. Sorry, sorry, not Sussex. Oh, and Westies, if you reverse sweep again, I'm going to drop you, I swear. <laughs> Edged for four? No, just four runs. Not out. Okay, five overs to get um, 13 runs and get that second batting bonus point. I wouldn't mind it. And that's four of them. Yeah, great. Five runs now in four overs. Two, nine, eight. One more four, and we'll take an extra batting point. There we go. <clears throat> Brilliant stuff, and now we do just focus completely on the game at hand. Prest is doing all right. Tom Westy's actually doing all right as well. Um, Rossington, it is annoying to lose a wicket so quickly at the start of the day, but, you know, it's what it is. He did get 45, so I can't really complain about it. A good 45 yesterday. But without that break in play, you never know. He might have actually gone on to a big score. But that is what multi-day cricket is about. You've got to be able to bat, take a break, and then bat again. Reset. It's all a mental game as well as a physical game. And let's, yeah, now we can afford to go next level up with them both. Oh, good delivery. Shot. Yeah, really good shot. Nothing there. 350 is up. Wesley creeping to 50. And Tom Prest is... Oh, my word. Uh. Hold on, 99. There's lunch right before the break. Oh, I feel so bad for the guy. And Westy's gone as well. Okay, that was that was silly.
really silly. Oh, I don't know what to say. Bold on 99. I don't. I'm not actually a shot. Wowza. I'm not actually sure. I need to check because I know Presta's batted well for us in many a game, but has he. Yeah, he doesn't have 100 yet. He's got 50s. He has batted well for us, but 99 and to get bold. Oh, man, I feel for the guy. I really do. Yeah, cool, cool. And um, we're going to up the aggression one more because we're kind of. We're kind of uh, wasting a bit of time now. I'd much rather we took a bit of a swing and uh, hopefully get some runs. But, well, there we go. That's Wokesy doing just the opposite and just getting bold. Um, but 400 runs, a 400 lead would be nice. Uh, 392 just now, so we're not quite at 400 just yet, but we're very close. And there's four for Gates, so 396. Uh, oh, very close. And there's the 400. Okay, 400 is up. Um, let's see if Richards can just smack a little bit. Yeah, good stuff. Because he's quite settled. Yeah, great work. And this is why we're kind of batting as deep as we are. Tell Gates to also kind of step up, go a little bit more aggressive as well. Six runs. Oh, and there we go. Gone. 36. Okay. Um, is there any point continuing on? I mean, I'm not really sure. I mean, we'll take that. Well, that's good. That's pretty good. If we can get 450 before the end of the session, maybe. It's not out. 441, 20 minutes left. Hold him. Okay. And 443. Four, three. We'll just bat to the end of the session. That's what we'll do. We'll bat to the end of the session. And there we go. That's fine. 4-4-4. Four, 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 the quadruple Nelson. 4-4-5. Four, four, One more boundary and we're there. We're basically there. 450. Okay. Let's just auto play to the end of the session. 450 is up. That's really good. We don't get the batting points for it. But, you know, it's quite good that we've, as a as a side, as a team, we've been able to put together some good and good runs, four five five. Um, it doesn't even matter if you know we lose a wicket here now. Great stuff. Only two or three overs left. Four sixty, and then we'll declare the end of this over, or we'll get bold. Okay, fine. Porter, you know, get seventy. That's fine. That's actually not so bad. And then we'll get one over at Rory Burns. Okay. Um. Let's give it to Wokesy. Okay, nothing from it that first over. That's okay. Um, second over we'll give to Porter. Actually not ideal there, going for some runs. Boundaries off every over. This is not the start we want here, guys. Need to tighten the line up a little bit. There we go. That's a bit better. The pitch is already turning. So after 10, if we haven't got a wicket, which we looks like we probably won't. There we go. 10. Let's keep Wokesy bowling, but we'll give the ball to Simon Harmer. And uh, change him out now for Richards. Oh, the bowling change could be the difference. And it is. Ryan will take the catch. And we've got on our first wicket. 55 for one. Okay, good stuff. Richards to a shack. 
Edgehan taken by Harmer and Richards has both wickets already on a turning pitch. It's actually Jamal Richards, the youngster, who's looking pretty good. We take his form with the bat, it's not been great. We take his form with the ball, it's been a lot of wickets. A lot more wickets. I'm quite impressed, I've got to say, I'm quite impressed. Um, can we actually check his, his records? He's played only three games. <laughs> yeah, he's not played a lot. Played a lot more first class. He doesn't doesn't bat a lot in first class, clearly. But oh no, sorry, only three games and then that's matches. I was gonna say, yeah, that's overs. Averaging twenty. Averaging twenty seven on the bowling. Not bad. It's not that bad. Don't actually mind it. The economy at five is a is a touch high, but I don't mind it. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's finish up the over. Good stuff. Very aggressive. Simon Harmon's going to keep bowling. Oh, maybe we can get Rory Burns. Here we go. Oh, okay. I don't think there's a wicket there. Fine. Ollie Pope. Can we get Ollie Pope early? Playing a miss. Fine. Change Richards now. We'll bring on... We'll bring on Gates. We'll actually bring on Gates. Um, so that we've got spin at both ends. Just to round out the session. If we could get another wicket. For the end of the session. Oh, there we go. We've gone up. And it's not going to be given. 323 runs behind they are. Still on a turning pitch, but let's give the ball back to um give the ball back to Richards. He was the one who got the wickets. So yeah. Armor to Pope. No run, okay. Oh, that's gone. That's so gone. Yeah, there we go. Ben Folks comes in. Oh, and we could get Folks early, maybe. We've gone up. It's not going to be given. Armour to Pope. We do need to get rid of Pope here because he's actually batting pretty quickly, pretty rapidly. Um, that's a play and a miss. Richards, you've bowled really well, but we're going to have to change it up. Um, let's bring on Tom Wesley for a few overs. Just, I know he's not really a full-time bowler, really, but he may be able to just get something out of this pitch that we aren't expecting. Going to be a few too many. And again, we're kind of going for a few too many here. So let's go defensive on Pope. We'll bring on back, bring back Richards. And there we go. Pope's finally gone. Fine. Finally. Okay. Back to a, just an average field here. We're going to bowl outside the off stump. Incredible stuff. Okay, Simon Harmer's getting a bit tired. So let's bring back Gates. And maybe Gates can grab a wicket here. If we could start tumbling through a few wickets. Oh, you could have caught that. You could have caught that, I reckon. Come on. Gates is going for a few too many runs, but if he does grab a wicket. Uh, okay, I'm afraid Gates I can't really justify Gates having more time with the ball. So we're going to go back to Wokesy.
because this lead is kind of slipping now. We do need to get these wickets. Like we know, to be fair, sorry, I've got one of the scariest teams around. Still got Will Jacks, Sam Curran to come. So, yeah. Let's try it. Let's try and go aggressive here. And see what we can do. The aggressive field, maybe that's what will do it. There we go. Okay, it did instantly grab it. We'll go same again on Will Jacks. No, I don't really want the new ball. Can we get... Here we go. The aggressive field. Maybe that's the difference. There we go. That's gone as well. Don't really want to go super aggressive with um with folks here. I'd rather that the pace bowlers were just kind of bowling their regular line. And Simon Harmer is the one getting wickets at the other end. We could have if we had gone aggressive earlier, maybe we would have grabbed some some wickets a bit earlier. But there we go. There's another one. Richards has got his fourth of the game. And we're really relying on two bowlers here to grab the wickets. We can get another one here. Early on, we do. Wow. Okay. Atkinson's gone. Oh, it could be two and two. It could be two and two. Well, okay. We're not going up. Fine. Richards, two jacks. We've gone up for the edge and it's going to be given. And Richard gets his five for her. What a performance. What a performance. Fair enough. Fair enough, lad. And they might be able to finish it off. Not out. Okay, fair enough. Simon Harmer. Come on, finish it up. Finish it up and give us a bit of a lead going into the last. Not quite. Richards, your turn. And there he is. What a catch from Nick Brown. And we've got a lead of 77 runs to uh to play with here. Richards gets six for. What a performance. What a performance. Really good stuff. And on a on a horrible looking pitch, we're gonna have to try and grab a lead if possible. I don't want to do anything silly in this session. We're gonna just try and build a bit of a lead here. Brown's gone early. Okay, fine. Not much I can do about that. There's T. Unfortunately, we do lose a wicket. But we've got a lead of 99, so we could afford to lose that one wicket. Let's just hope Rymel can stick around. I think that's lucky not to be given. This is when, yeah, that's good. This is when you've really got to try and show your class here, Rymel. You've been given a chance in the top team. Bavuma at the other end doesn't help doing stuff like that. Does he? No, he does not. It's not out. It's a horrible pitch to bat on, clearly. Like, look at the uneven bounce, the turning pitch. 200 runs, 250 runs, and you would kind of think that we've got enough in the bank. Um, but we want to want to build a lead, and we want to try and build a lead a bit quicker this time. We're going to have to try and bat a little bit differently. Oh, that's in the air, but that should be safe from Rymel. It is indeed. 61 for 2, and we've, we've batted... We've batted a little bit faster this time, actually, have we? 20? Yeah, we have. We're we're at three and over, whereas last time I don't think we were at all. Um, yeah, well, a touch faster, but sorry, batted way faster if you look at that. Um, get rid of my innings. I'm batting closer to how they did, but they kind of accelerated with that with that partnership from um from folks and. Ollie Pope. That's not out. It's missing leg. Okay, good stuff. 
The lead's up to 150. I don't mind that at all. And Rymel's looking, he's actually looking okay. And it cannot be easy to bat out there right now. So like, he's actually looking pretty good. I'm I'm quite impressed after after that kind of struggle in the first innings. Didn't really, or didn't really contribute at all. There's the end of day three. Okay, 174. We oh, need that to go to sharp turn. The bounce is uneven. Gonna try and give them a few overs to get themselves settled. That'll help Rymel a lot. Ah, but then next ball out can't quite get, can't quite get the uh, the. Oh, and that's edge for four. Lucky a fifty, which I would have been really proud of him. I really would have. I'm proud of him anyway. He's batted pretty well to get forty-seven. Shot. That's a cracking shot. That's a great shot as well from Russington. Four runs. And the lead will be up to almost 200 now. And it should be past 200 now, in fact. It is 202. 202. You can, you, uh, you can get 200 runs, but... It's not, we're nowhere near declare, declaration time yet. So I do think we're going to bat this first session and kind of see where we are. Uh, Prest is gone, unfortunately. And Rossington follows not very long after. Try and bat the session, guys. Just try and bat the session. That's the first thing. Just slap it back to him. One three seven, the lead up to two ten. Shot, yeah, it's a good shot from Richards. Probably buoyed by the fact that he's uh, already taken six wickets. And um, we're up to the sharp turn now on the pitch, so our spinners should have a really good time of it, as theirs are currently. Um, Moriarty's already grabbed three and is going for like no runs and over. Two eighteen. Got gates out of the crease. I told I like I said, I just want to bat the session first because I want to take time out of the game. Um to try and stop sorry from getting a word. Wokesy, come on, buddy. You were settled as well. You were settled and you couldn't couldn't block a straight one. One five one for eight. It does kind of show how hard it is to bat on this pitch. Which Surrey will be looking at it and hopefully they'll be kind of worrying about it. My word, Harmer. It's bloody awful. <laughs> it really is not great. Um, I can't see this lasting very long from here. That's a good shot. Yeah. 168 for 9. 245 run lead. 250 and we've made lunch. So... It could be worth, it could be worse. We've got, oh, there we go. And that's it. 26 from Gates is quite valuable, to be fair. That He's done pretty well. Um, No runs really anywhere else. And now it all comes down to wickets with the spin. Okay, we're going to have to be careful here. We are going to have to be careful here. Been a good start. Because they don't look like they're really going for anything just yet. So let's up the ante even further. Go even more aggressive here. Their run rate is... Their run rate's nothing right now. And every wicket that falls is what we need. Ah, 
first chance isn't a isn't a wicket. Second chance, Harmer to Riley. We're just going to keep spin on for most of this game, honestly. There we go. That's the first wicket. Um, Simon Harmer can finish that over up. Harmer to Ishak. Can we get a second one? We can indeed. That's gone. Ollie Pope now. Gonna have to give it to Gates because I do not want to risk an injury here. Uh, but that's the problem with letting Gates bowl. He's he's too expensive. He's just a bit too expensive. Okay, to Porter. Okay, Porter's got a change. Wokesy. And I'm actually going to go to a regular field here for Wokesy. Oh, that's close, but no cigar. Okay, an hour and a half. Sorry, need 137. We need eight wickets in. Not very. And there's Pope gone. Okay. Oh, could we get Burns as well? Oh, we can't. Okay. We're still going aggressive here with Harmer. We know we've got a chance here. And he's grabbed it. Okay, we've definitely got a chance here. Two wickets in two overs. And that just flips the switch. We've got an hour 21 to try and get these wickets. Smith has smacked some runs there. Wokes to Smith. Oh, is that a dropped catch? Oh, come off it. Wokes to Wokes. No, Wokes to Folks. Wokes to Smith. Oh. Armour to Folks. We've got to get these wickets. There we go. There's one. Folks is gone. Will Jacks. This is, this is going to come right down to the wire. We've got an hour and five to go. A hundred runs for Surrey to get. It's yeah, hell. Oh, it's gonna come down to the wire, or could it be? Works to Smith. There's no edge. There's no edge. Salmon Harmer to Jacks. Okay, if he can get Will Jacks out. Oh my word! It's been dropped. Oh, it's been dropped again. That's two wickets dropped. You have to do it yourself, Harmer. There's the Pfeiffer. There's the Pfeiffer. Okay, Wokesy's done really well, but let's change him out for Richards. Um, okay. Oh, I can't risk Simon Harmer getting injured, so a few overs to Will Gates. And maybe we can get one wicket, and then we'll go back to Simon Harmer. Oh, that's out. Come on, surely that's out. What's wrong with that? Richards, the current, edged and taken. Okay. Okay, 21 minutes left. Gus Atkinson out of the crease. Okay, we're going to have to go aggressive. We need the wickets. And Simon Harm is going to come back. Three overs to go. Oh, no, 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 no. There's three wickets to get. Oh, I don't think that's out. And that's that match drawn. Oh, we gave it a good go. We really did. We really did. Fair play on Surrey as well. Like, they weren't that far off. Uh, they really weren't that far off. Richards does get man of the match for that incredible six for But Harmer with the five for the nine over the... Oh, what a game. 460 all out. 383. So we had a lead of 77. We told them you've got to chase 250. 250 and they got to 220 what a game really what a game hampshire beat sussex oh my word how have they done that they must have been told to follow on and then they punished in the second innings and then they bowled sussex out but all with a 50 in the second as well james vince with a 50 and a 100 really good stuff crane with seven wickets archer with four yeah look really good stuff 
Durham get the win over Kent, 94 all out. Oh my word, they chased it. They only needed 24, and they still lost two wickets on these on these really tough pitches. Yorkshire, Somerset get the win. Right, fair enough. And that's really going to condense the table. We've moved up to sixth with that draw. Surrey also got the draw. And yeah, a win, and we'll kind of jump to the next level. But Sussex with the loss, and it had to be against Hampshire. We need Sussex to lose more games. <laughs> We really do. We really do. Okay, back to the blast for a little bit. We've got, what have we got? We've got one, two, three, four, five blast games before a big game against Sussex. Okay. Paul Walter's out. Bell Drummond's out. Travis Head is back. Jamie Porter's out. What? What is happening? What is happening with all these injuries? We'll have to deal with it next time, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching today's episode. It was a really close game. Just praying for the wickets at the end there. We couldn't keep Simon Harmer bowling because if Simon Harmer got injured, I don't know what I'd do. My prime spinner, I don't know what I'd do. So there we go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I shall catch you next time.